morning, the Boston Morning Express. Peter Groom. Well, well, but what about me for? It's all right with you, Mr. Birch. Well, I don't know. Oh, no, 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 you don't, you don't do that to me. I never heard of such an outrageous thing. Well, I'd rather go to prison for the rest of my life. Oh, well, go on and think about yourself all the time. What about Bobby and Susie? Well, you have to get license, and there's all details that have to be taken. You just... Who's marrying whom? Whom, my dear? Well, yes, Wilbur, in the case of extreme urgency, I guess. It's a matter of utmost urgency, Your Honor. This is Miss Jones, Mr. Garvey. Good morning, Judge. How are you? Come in. <laughs> I'm sorry, Reverend. I've been asked to take over. No, Emery, don't do it! Will you, Peter Garvey, take this woman whom you are now holding by your right hand? you are now holding by your right hand, to be your lawful wedded wife, do you promise to love, honor, and cherish her, and forsaking all others, keep yourself for her alone as long as you both do live? I do. Do you, Emmett L. Jones, take this man whom you are now holding by your right hand, to be your lawful wedded husband? Do you promise to love, honor, and keep yourself to him alone as long as you both do live? Well, um, I do. Uh, place the ring on her finger and repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. Oh, well. Can't win. Now, in the presence of God and these witnesses, and by which you will be authority vested in me by the laws of this state, I pronounce you man and wife. Huh. Congratulations, Mr. Garvey. Thanks. You've been right neighborly. Sorry, I'm here. I'm sorry, Wilbur. Ah, oh, fooey, nobody's sorry. Wow, wow! <laughs> Can't you take those things off now, Mr. Burchett? If you say so, Mr. Stanley. Come on, Mother. <laughs> Thank you, Bobby. Emmy, Emmy, it'll be an awful life. You'll have laughs, though. Come Thank heavens I can take this corset off. You know, I told you someday you'd slip on a banana peel. Hmm? Meet the banana peel. Bertrand of the FBI, it turns out, is actually a fellow reporter of mine on the Express. Glad to know you, Mr. Stanley. Danny, you were sensational. Well, indeed, oh, that was a great performance. Oh, it's a pleasure to pay you. Pete, I love you. Yeah, You're yeah. wonderful. Don't I get a byline? <laughs> well, we'll see about that. You're amazing, Mr. Garvey. On the floor for the count of nine, and you still got up to win by a knockout. You're pretty amazing yourself. It's been fun. Loads of fun, Mr. Garvey. Take good care of the kissing cousin now, won't you? Want to wrestle? <laughs> when the party's getting a glow on, singing fills the air. Now, if a wedding is nigh, I bring your own FBI. Emmy? Well, you didn't think you were kidding me, did you? That's my M. <laughs> you get that.